Okay, hi guys. While well, I was uh, cleaning up my, uh, my quad, really, I wanted to uh, demonstrate you a little uh, trick how to get a uh, louder uh, buzzer than you would normally have on your flight controller. If you uh, have been using Nasus for some time, just like me, you know that uh, there is uh, buzzer pins on the uh, on the Nase. Uh, in the, the version I'm using right now, that's a Rev6. Uh, those pins are uh, located over here. A 5 volt buzzer. You connect it up to your uh, to your flight controller, and it gets its power from the flight controller, being 5 volts. And then, uh, if you either have a low bed signal or you program a beeper, then you actually get uh, some nice noise. Let me demonstrate that for you. So in this case, actually during in it, it already gives you a uh, nice. Beat. So the free beeps you hear now, those are the flight controller. So and typically if you arm, well, like this, you hear some beeps. And then also if you program a uh, switch for buzzer, like I have in this case, you can make it do uh, beeping. And while it sounds nice here and now, it is uh, not so loud when you're in the field. So uh, building some other uh, craft uh, lately. I. Uh, I actually got uh, this ID from a Tornado flight controller which allows for uh, 4S uh, buzzers. So that got me thinking uh, and knowing uh, that uh, some of the flight controllers, they really, what they do with the buzzer, they only switch the ground signal. So it doesn't really matter what, uh, what voltage signal you supply to the buzzer, it only switches to the ground. Uh, so what that allows you is actually to, to get a little bit of a different buzzer. Like this is one I uh, got from, uh, I don't know, Banggood or AliExpress. I'll uh, put the link in the uh, description. And this one is actually rated up until 20 volts or 25 volts. And it's a bit kind of a big boy, as you can see. And that's because it actually gives you 95 decibels at uh, one meter. Whereas the normal ones, I'm sure they don't go higher than 85 or something. So what the beauty of this is, knowing that the, the flight controllers typically switch to ground signal only, you can just connect this one. I've connected this one to the uh, to the to the power to the power OSD flight controller over here. So it's actually just connected to LiPo power on the plus side. So if I then uh, connect that to the uh, ground on the buzzer, uh, the one closest to the board, as you can see over here, and then I fire up my uh, again, uh, then uh, you will hear some other different noises. So actually this one has had some wear and tear already, but it's still uh, quite loud uh, as you could hear from this. So if I put it in buzzer mode now, it's actually quite loud. So I hope you like this simple trick. Works for me, finding my quad back in the field. Hope it works for you as well. Have a nice day.